gal. What's going on everybody? Hey, today's video, I have got you the best sidearm in the game. So I've tested a lot of sidearms from Dring um, to the Requiem to all the other uh, legendaries that have just dropped for me and none of them have been quite as efficient as this one. So you can see the stats on screen. I'm not gonna do too much into it. There's a, there's a slight stat switch that does allow it to um, have more range. Um, and less stability um but uh it, it's kind of iffy it's it's one of those things that it, it's personal preference of what you decide as a player um i personally want the most stability i can get but i'm also gonna take a try at the range and see how that fares um if you're looking for a sidearm that is consistent it will never fail you of what it's supposed to do and how it's supposed to perform then you're looking for the last hope because that's exactly what it is. When your primary has gone to shit and you're looking for that little extra oomph to take out the enemy, you need the, your last hope. You want the gun that's just geared to take down enemies so quickly. But it's not also good for PvP. It's really, really good for PvE as well. I did a direct comparison a few videos ago, if you saw that, um, on... Uh, that and the lion Lionheart the grenade launcher the exotic grenade launcher of how many enemies you can kill with one magazine or clip of of The last hope versus how many enemies you can kill with a single clip of this exotic grenade launcher and The last hope won by a lot. I killed three enemies and still had nine rounds to go And it only takes a burst to kill a low-level enemy while at the same time, it kicked an entire grenade to kill a, a low-level enemy of, of the grenade launcher. So, with that being said, if you need something reliable, you can see that the ranges it's killing at. It's pretty, pretty damn amazing. Uh, go give it a try. My bet is it is the best sidearm in the game right now. All right, a lot of people are getting their hands on the Rat King sidearm. That makes you go invisible after re reloading after getting a kill, which is a great feature to have. I mean, it, it's it's a damn good sidearm. I've seen a lot of crazy things happen uh, with that sidearm in hand. But this is your best bet for legendaries. If you need a legendary that's trustworthy and isn't going to fail you at range, up close, in that hard spot, then you want to give Last Hope a try. All right, guys, stick around, watch the rest of the gameplay. You're going to see some pretty damn good kills. Um, we ended up doing pretty well. I want you to see it for yourself. There's a couple times to where you could just tell that they're playing really, really cheeky, where they just want to set back fucking scout rifle and not really engage. So that was kind of boring, but we got a lot of cool kills. Took on a sword as our trustworthy power weapon, and uh, you'll see where it goes from there. Uh, there's uh, some good, there's some bad, and there's some ugly. But either way, the gameplay was definitely fun and uh, pretty exciting across the board. So let me know what you guys think. What do you think the best sidearm is in the game? I'm going to stop babbling. Uh, it's late. Pretty tired. Wanted to get out another video. And I'm going to throw some music on in the background. All right, guys. Stay awesome. Till next time. Deathstroke.
I'm so happy I can't lie, 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 I'm so